Quality assurance and quality control are commonly confused terms in software testing. Both processes are meant to improve product quality, but they are not alike. So what exactly do quality assurance and quality control mean? Quality assurance, that is QA, serves as a validation process to ensure that the product has met its requirements. In short, the process assures expected quality for the product. Quality control, that is QC, ensures that all the necessary procedures, methodologies, and techniques have been followed to ensure a defect-free product. QA and QC. How do they differ? By nature of the process, QA is a preventative process that is used to establish methods that can prevent bugs. QC is a corrective process that can identify and fix errors. In terms of focus, QA's focus will be on the quality of verification process, while QC's focus will be on the entire product. How do they work? QA Quality Management System Continuous Monitoring Necessary Modification Meet Predetermined Objectives QC Technology, that is tools, plus testing skills, find product quality problems and defects. Activities involved in QA include document review, test cases review, walkthrough, inspection, etc. QC activities include functional testing, test automation, compatibility testing, integration testing, etc. Example QA Process checklist, standards, documentation, and project audit. QC Inspection, peer reviews, and software testing process. Which resources are involved? QA, everybody in the development team is a part of the process. QC, a dedicated team skilled in testing. Differences in statistical technique. QA, since process-oriented parameters and inputs are involved, SPC, that is, statistical process control graphs are used. While for QC, since graphs are used for finished product, SQC, that is, statistical quality control graphs are required. QA and QC difference in terms of time consumed. QA consumes less time, while QC is an extensive process that consumes a lot of time. Things to keep in mind. You have to learn about the difference between CMM or ISO 9000 to understand the process better. Don't ever call the process that your QC team do as QA. Scaling development process requires QA. We hope that explained the key differences between QA and QC. 